Quando o Lula está a Deixar os carros que não? Through the skin, through the deep temporal fascia, through the muscle, onto the bone. Aspirate. Elevate. Give half a melobin injection. Next we're going to use the lift for the brow lift, so we look for blood vessels, we can see a little vessel there, so we're going to lift up the brow sharp scratch coming up. Sorry, it's a little bit maybe as we go through that fascia. We elevate the brow. We feel the end of my angle here. Elevate the brow. And get half a mil there. And then mold that is irregularities and we just prevent any bruising from coming out by pressing the nice little touch. So next we'll be doing three injections into the cheeks and that'll be part of the cheek video but it'll also be part of the eight point lift video as well. First injection point is, is the lateral brow and we drop our line down to the point of the cheek. So, so we elevate Sharp scratch down to the bone, aspirate and then inject 0.25. And we're using our middle finger to protect the orbital rim so that the product doesn't go into the eyelid, stays in the cheek. So that's 0.25. Next line is lateral canthus, same line, sharp scratch, down onto the bone, aspirate, use our ring finger to protect the orbital bit this time, get down to 0.5, so we've done 0.25 of a mil, and last injection is lateral canthus. Our cheeks done. That's part of the cheeks. So we're going to give the lift, the lift, the lima, the lift, the lift. So the lima, I'm just going to give over here a sharp scratch.
time with the pre-auricular sulcus, we're going to be using a cannula just to spread the area and a little, spread the treatment a little bit wider. So this is our area of volume loss. Our cannula can enter here and it can provide volumization to that whole area there. So here's our entry point sharp scratch. pre-auricular region with the cannula, what we want to do is we want to break down the tissues in the subcutaneous plane, almost in a subcision manner, and while we're breaking it down, we're not actually injecting. Once we've broken it down, then we can start injecting through that wide area. And the tissue plane is important. You don't want to go too deep and you don't want to go too superficially. So, that's just been creating a little bit of um, collagen stimulation at that point there as well. So it will continue to work over the course of time. And that's the treatment done.